everyone, welcome to another video of our video blog Gofundi Aluminum Casting. Today I would like to introduce you to our manual casting process in a green sand mold on our casting carousel. In previous videos I had already given you a little insight into the world of casting. We talked about the closing of the casting molds with cores, the robot assisted casting process on our casting carousel and about its flexibility. Here I would like to take up the topic of flexibility once again. We have two different techniques to cast on our carousel in a green sand mold. We not only cast with a robot, but we also cast manually. In this process, two employees usually carry out the manual casting. This also comes with possible dangers. They have to be very careful and must respect the protection rules because if not, they can burn themselves on the hot aluminum. Of course, a human being does not cast as evenly as a robot, but if the caster is good and has many years of experience, he surely can compete with a robot. The advantage of casting manually is that you are more flexible. Sometimes there are parts that require a double sprue. Then you have to pour manually, because the robot can only pour into one hopper, and the workers can pour in two at the same time. And the final reason why we also cast manually is that the robot is used for large casting batches. If our customers only need a small casting batch of 20 parts, for example, then it is not worth using it. Since we have the required flexibility here at Kofundi and can cover a wide range of casting processes, it is no problem for us to accept casting batches of of different length. That's it for today on the subject of manual green sand casting on our carousel. If you liked our video, please give us a like. If you would like to learn more about the world of aluminum casting, then follow us on our YouTube channel or take a look on our website www.kofundi.com. Thank you very much.